Five days before the concert, security arrangements are in place and Gardaí are busy hauling away fast food vans which have moved into positions where the Gardaí and City Council don't want them. The Council has warned that any of them cooking food in the vicinity of the concert will be breaching hygiene regulations and open to prosecution. As the Gardaí put their security arrangements into effect, construction crews moved into Parky Cueve to begin erecting the huge stage for Jackson to do his hot footsteps. The GAA is still £720,000 in debt on Parky Cueve, and this concert should help to reduce that debt, though today officials were refusing to say by how much. Promoter Oliver Barry, who's never actually met Jackson, is happy with the interest in the concert, though also not disclosing how much he's likely to make from it. But with all tickets sold out for Saturday, and only 6,000 said to be available still for Sunday, estimates put ticket sales alone at about £2 million. The whole event should be an economic boost for Cork. Accommodation is completely booked out according to latest reports, and even private homes will be renting out space. Jacko's own accommodation location remains a secret, but certainly won't be in the seven-acre free camping site adjacent to the park.